Guys, Andrew here and welcome back to Drew Tutorial and in this video I'm going to show you episode 5 of Make Your Computer Faster. And here in this episode I'm going to share with you 6 commands that you can run to boost your Windows PC or laptop performance, right? So you will need your command prompt to do so, so click the Windows key on your keyboard, simple type in CMD, you will see towards the right hand side, run as administrator, or you can simply right click on that and click run as administrator. Then go ahead and click on yes. Once you get that little pop up and you will be able to run whatever commands that I'll be sharing with you as administrator, right? So the first one that I would like to share with you guys, and this is very popular, is the SFC space can now. So you can simply go ahead and type in SFC space forward slash scan now, right? Go ahead and type that in and you want to hit enter. It's gonna quickly go ahead and verify and you want to allow this to complete. So allow this a few minutes for it to complete. And once this is completed, I will go ahead and share the next command that you can check. And there you have it guys, the SFC space can now actually runs and it did not find any integrity violations on my computer. So that is good. So you can restart your computer, see how that works. If this doesn't work, you can also try other commands as well, which I'll be sharing right here within this video. So the next command that you can run here, guys, is simply run this DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup image space forward slash restore health. So go ahead and run this command on your computer as well. This will take a little bit longer time than the SFC space can now, but you want to allow this to run on your computer because this will definitely help to boost and speed up your computer performance. As you can see, depending on the computer speed that you have, it will be fast or it will take a little bit time, give it a few minutes and then allow this to complete, but it will definitely help your computer performance in the end. And there you have it guys, it is successful. And as you can see, the restore operation complete successfully, the operation complete successfully without any issues. You can go ahead and restart your computer as well. And you should see massive improvement in your computer performance once you restart your computer. So guys, the next command that you can use here is the power CFG. So you want to simple type in power CFG space forward slash list. And this is going to show you the list of active power schemes that you have. And as you can see, I have two of them. Now, how do you choose one? You have the balance and you have the high performance. And if you have others, you will see it. So this is very easy to do. So all you have to do is just simply go ahead and type power CFG space forward slash set active space and the GUID of that power scheme that you want simple hit enter and it will set it as active for you. So I'll put in this within the description as well so that you have the examples so that you know exactly how to do this. Now the next command that you want to use guys is the group policy. So it's to simple update your group policy. So in case you're having luggage on your computer or your computer is simply moving sluggish, you can simply type in GP update and you want to do a space forward slash Force. Now, this will go ahead and update your group policy for you. So just allow it some time to do the update and this will improve the performance if your computer is acting up or moving sluggish. Now, the last and final one that I will share with you guys that you can use is the clean MGR, right? So in case you're having any problems with your computer, you can simply run this clean MGR command and this will in fact help your computer to clean up and improve your computer efficiency, speed, and this will definitely help you going forward. Here you have it guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.